Here's a look at what's going on. We'll take a look at this in a second. Uh, here's a look at the big picture. It's going to get a little bit better coming up for tomorrow, but it's going to take a while for it to get here. Uh, it'll only be gradual, and I think by the end of the day, we're going to see sunshine through the area. But we're seeing a, a little bit of patchy fog during the overnight hours and a lot of cloud cover. Now, we could still see a little bit of mist overnight. First thing in the day coming up for tomorrow, but I don't think it's going to be even as big as what we had during the day today, and that wasn't all that much. Here's where we are at midnight. Again, lots of cloud cover continues to move in overnight. Uh, pretty much clouds everybody up by 7 o'clock in the morning. Temperatures don't change all that much overnight, but then during the day it'll change. It'll be into this low to mid 60s near the water's edge, but low to mid 70s farther inland. So a huge temperature range throughout the area during the day tomorrow. And by the end of the afternoon, we're likely to see at least a little bit more sunshine, certainly by uh, the dinner hour, 7 o'clock in the evening. And winds will become more east and then southeasterly and then southerly coming up by Thursday morning. That's a good sign. We've had a north to northeast wind now for the past few days, and that's kept us in the cool air. Uh, however, we are going to end up with some warmer air coming in for the day on Thursday. Here's where we are by 11 o'clock in the morning already into the 70s. Uh-oh, rain? Eh, not really. Uh, it's a little wind shift line, and the rain falls apart. We end up uh, with a little bit of cloud cover, but there's a secondary shot of rain out there, and that one looks likely to survive with showers and thunderstorms at 5 o'clock entering the area. So around the dinner hour, we're likely to see some rainfall move in on Thursday, 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock. Again, still some thunderstorms into the area. We'll have to watch for this real, real carefully. It's going to be warm on Thursday, uh, but that line of thunderstorm signals a cool front dropping through. There's where things are by Friday morning, more of a northerly wind, but by the end of the day, more of a an easterly wind and becoming more southerly again by Saturday. And that'll warm things back on up into the 80s. There's we are by Sunday, well on up into the 80s, quite likely. Uh, and even uh, and uh, southerly wind continues. 65 degrees, but that's kind of an average. It'll be between 60, 65 near the coastline, 70, 75 degrees well inland. And we could see a little bit of mist during the morning hours and some patchy fog. Uh, for Thursday, there's a chance of a few thunderstorms late in the afternoon toward the dinner hour warm day, cooler on Friday, warmer again on Saturday and into the weekend, and it stays that way into the first part of next week.